In July 2005, ArtReach celebrated the kickoff of the Family Arts Project, a five-month music and visual arts residency which brought together mothers and children from the Druding Center in North Philadelphia, residents from the nearby neighborhood, and artists from the Clay Studio and Strings for Schools. This project was a big shift for us because it was really an effort to, in, a, uh, in addition to providing some arts events, uh, really providing some hands-on participatory arts activity. The Clay Studio believes in, in broad access to art education. Art making is something that is, uh, is good for everyone, not only uh, people who are professionals. Philadelphia at one time had one of the largest musical programs throughout the United States and music has almost been entirely eliminated over the years. So Strings for Schools is trying to remedy that by bringing music back into the schools with all sorts of outreach programs. The project featured 18 hands-on workshops, field trips to the Clay Studio and the Philadelphia Orchestra, a community performance at Halloween featuring an exhibit of the participants' artwork and a final holiday exhibit and performance which gave participants the opportunity to perform on handmade instruments alongside the Barnett String Quartet. For five months, over 30 workshop participants gathered each Wednesday evening with professional artists to explore the art forms of music and clay. I really enjoyed the clay part because I never worked with clay before and uh, now I see how they make pots and stuff like that and bowls and dishes. So it was really interesting and it was a great opportunity for us being, you know, homeless families. Nobody like really comes out to do stuff like that for us. So it was a good opportunity for the kids to have something else to do besides sitting in the house all the time. I was amazed at how um, Mr. Davis could get the music tunes out of blocks. The, 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 the fiddle. The yeah, the, the wooden spoons. <laughs> I like this program because we, we learn new things that we did not know, and it's fun. Some people, they just came in and they don't know like how to make the instruments and music, and some people didn't know how to mess with play and make things. So for some people, it's new. We had a good time working together. Um, I had to help Kalina a lot, and I helped Imani a little bit. Imani helped me a lot. It was good working together, just being together and learning from each other. This was a great opportunity for us as well to, to reach a, a program that the kids and the parents could work together on art and and bring the you know bring a sense of satisfaction to to themselves and you know in relationship with each other. I'm not moving mountains here, but I'm giving someone in a really tough situation um, a good hour and a half. You know, if if the Druding Center, the kind of work that they're doing, they're they're taking a population of women who have a lot of stress and, and a lot of uh, needs that are real physical material needs and we're giving them a chance to do something entirely different. I'm not too sure how many opportunities they've had to do this kind of thing. I'm just so upset that it's such a short program. I just I think that they should stay here with the kids.